So I did move in with my boyfriend at the beginning of the pandemic. Uh, very exciting. Uh, I do still go back to my apartment once a week just to fart. <laughs> <laughs> So great not having roommates, oh my gosh. When you have roommates in your 20s, it's kind of fun. You know, it's like, oh my God, we're all friends. When you have roommates in your 30s, it's like, well, we made some choices, huh? <laughs> oh, look at us, we're all living our dreams. <laughs> Still. <laughs> oh yeah, I had uh, probably about 50 roommates since college, I think. I even lived in an artist commune once. Yeah, one guy was a painter. One guy was inventing instruments, he claimed. <laughs> one guy was just French, I think. <laughs> Never got to the bottom of it. My two favorite roommates of all time, I lived with uh, this British girl and this Australian girl. And the British girl was a supermodel, all right? The Australian girl was a mess, okay? <laughs> British girl would always come in like, girls, girls, I've been very naughty. <laughs> I've just eaten a cookie. <laughs> and the Australian girl would hobble in like, last night I let a strange man sleep in my bed. <laughs> and he's still there. <laughs> the British girl hated the Australian girl and she would always complain to me like, oh, Katie, I don't know what to do. I went into the kitchen. Kelly was drinking my tea. I know, I'm just like, well, listen, girl, this is America, okay? You have to fight her. <laughs> I did like the Australian girl better, but really because I felt a sense of colonial obligation towards her. Yeah. I was like, have a tea party, screw the queen. And uh, we had mice in that apartment too. Oh, don't you hate that? One night I came home late and there was a mouse caught on the glue trap. The worst, right? Ugh, and I said to the British girl, I go, what are we gonna do? She goes, oh, I know, Katie. Why don't we just call a man, hmm? I know, I'm like, call a man? <laughs> Listen, sister, it's 3 a.m., okay? In this country, that counts as asking for it. <laughs> We just waited for the Australian girl to come home and she picked it up with her bare hands. <laughs> oh, I got it. Like, oh, God bless you, you monster. <laughs> she would have been my all-time favorite roommate if she ever paid rent. 